Welcome back, Liger Pack. Great to have you here once more. And today we're going to be talking about NFTs and more precisely, how to create them. And obviously, I've done a video in the past showing you how to do NFTs under the Wax blockchain. Going to link that in the corner of this video in case you're interested. But today we're going to be focusing on XDAI, which is a popular, you know, <laughs> solution for the Ethereum's massive gas fees. So XDAI is basically could we say a layer one layer two solution basically where the die token from ethereum is used to pay the transactions and obviously die is a stable coin and this has led to the transaction being really in the cost being around like hundred of a cent or something between doing dex trades interacting with smart contracts doing normal transfers and etc so this is mega affordable blockchain to use and i've become more and more bullish on it as time gone on with this congestion and obviously in the very near future, I plan to do videos on how to create NFTs on Ethereum and other popular blockchains, but not everybody has the necessary tools available for creators to basically do that. Now, there's three services which basically allow you to create NFTs on Exodai. The first one being a POR, which we're going to be using my, uh, today. Uh, there's another option called the Chiv Chivmint. This one is a curated list, so basically people have to submit their art and maybe they get selected and after that you get to like display your art here on the platform and they basically sell it. So that's how this works. And then there's the last one, which is called Unifty, which actually operates on multiple blockchains, Ethereum, XDAI, Binance, Smart Chain, Celo, Polygon, aka Matic Network. And basically, and then this arena be tested. And basically, uh, this is something that requires a license. So basically, it costs forty five dollars to basically do plus the gas. By the way, uh, NFTs on this platform, but they have a lot of interesting things like farm builder, NFT bridges, and things like that. And maybe if some of those developers are watching this video, they can maybe hook me up with this free pass, which allows you to issue NFTs for free. And I will be doing an exclusive video on this platform. But since we're going to be going for the affordable route, we're going to be using ePorio. So this is kind of like for um, testing purposes. And I mean, obviously, you can sell NFTs here. I just created an NFT not too long ago, which I put here on the sale. Sometimes it takes a bit of a time to actually load. And this is uh, the NFT that I did um, using the John Wick art and uh, did a one mint. You can go buy it out. But obviously, uh, with any art, there's always high standards. So we're going to be obviously jumping in to my Photoshop and we're going to be doing some custom art. <laughs>
okay, now that I have created the actual art for the NFT, we're gonna be obviously changing our MetaMask network into XDAI. I'm gonna leave those obviously in the description. Then we're gonna be going into the Create tab. Here's where we're gonna be uploading the media file. Far as I know, there's no limitations on the actual uh, size of it. So this is how it's gonna be looking as of right now. Then we're gonna be hitting Next. Uh, the name of the, obviously the NFT art, and I'm going to be calling it the Liger Poker Exclusive. And the description will be a limited edition uh, card only available on X Die Chain. Quantity, there's only going to be 15 of these in the future. So if you're watching this video, there might be still a chance you get one of these. Now it's gonna be hitting us the preview button. Oh yeah, let's actually go back. So there is the screen where it allows you to add an attribute. So these are kind of like for games and stuff like that. Obviously in this specific thing, we don't really need anything, but I'm gonna be putting the date here since, um, uh, you know, uh, date of creation. So people know when this has been created. And it actually takes the time. I don't think you can even edit the time. So this is a one way to verify this actually being made by me. And Light Liger, what was it? Liger, um, Liger Poker Exclusive, a uh, limited edition NFT card, only available on X Die. And adding that attribute again. So once again, there's a text number and date. Those can be like statistics for a card game um, and, and things like that. So, and then we're gonna be previewing it. Here's once again, how the card looks like here. I add a bit of a nice drop shadow here. So it kind of gives that feel that it's just like a card. And then we're gonna be hitting mint and a pop-up should be coming out any second. There we go, here is the actual fee. So this is in cents. So we're talking about a hundred of a cent here right now. Is, there, is that a thousand of a cent? Yeah, something like that. Confirm. And obviously the x chain is pretty fast. So it doesn't take a long time to actually like get the NFT being minted. And after that it's been minted, then I can basically uh, able to sell it or send it to some people uh, if I so desire. Um, it's going to be taking uh, probably a couple of seconds. Let's actually look into the, um, um, this, this, uh, speed up. Let's see how it's going. So, um, you might want to, I mean, it's not like NFT needs to be like done in a matter of seconds. I maybe put a like bit too low gas here, but it should be taking a, okay, it's been done. So now the NFT has been minted and now I can sell it. So I can go into my account here, my listings. Uh, here's the card we talked about earlier, and this is my address, by the way, so you know that uh, if there's any clones out of it. And here's the Liger Poker exclusive, so there's 15 out of them. Um, and we're going to be selling it. Here's the sell button. I'm going to be selling one of these. Um, token ID is 31. So these are going to be going for 2.5 die preview and sell. You have to um, approve the uh, amount. I think there's a bit of a fee for the for the service. Yes, there's a bit of a fee for the service. That's fine with me. Um, so we're gonna be accepting it, confirm. And now there's basically, it's going into sale. And if I want to sell another one, um, it's pretty easy, the simple same process. You can sell it in packs, obviously. You can sell them all. But I, I don't like that system. It's not like as great as some of the other ones that exist. But um, when it comes to sailing, they need a bit, uh, need a bit more overhauling on the system. Like the way you can get bulk trades or auctions is something that I would like to see on this website. But uh, that's how you basically do NFTs on XDAI and uh, how you sell them on the market as well. So uh, thanks for watching. If you have any questions, leave them down below in the in the comment section. See you soon. Cheers.